Well, just leaving the turnaround. Muddy McMuddy. The back was so muddy that it was a halfway up the wheels. We had to take the uh, log loader, put a chain on the back of the trailer, and he pushes and pulls you and turns you around that way rather than trying to do use a truck to get turned around. A little easier on things. Fun. All the rain we've got, probably got up to 200 millimeters of rain in the last month, maybe more. And the ground's just not taking it up very good. So, it is what it is. So, half a load on in the back, go to the second loader, put the other half a load on, and carry on. W990 has been working out pretty good. Motor pulls awesome. Bolts that hold the hood together are coming out. They need to be Loctited and fixed up. The rollover protection is overactive. I hate that. Spikes the brakes if you drive her too hard. Try to get up a hill. And the traction, traction control on it is a complete write off. Terrible. It's got a shut off switch that don't work for nothing as soon as it spins that's it you're done takes away your power so it is what it is spent the day at Kenworth yesterday trying to get things fixed up with that but I think they're feeding me a line of bull crap when they say they can't disable it Load me out of this pile on the left here. Beautiful out here in the back of northern north part of Elliott Lake. We're way up the Shoe Pack Road, 58 kilometers up. Lots of hills, lots of trees. Nice, nice. Oh, that machine's loading from behind. That's always a trick, too. It works out pretty good. Anyway, I'm gonna keep an eye on my loading and make sure I don't have any logs sticking out the side while he's loading me and that kind of stuff. It is what it is, so here we are. The shoe pack again, playing in the mud to the sky. <laughs> 